What's up guys and welcome back to our final video for Assassin's Creed Odyssey. Now if we get DLC for this game, new missions, stuff like that, we'll definitely check that out. But uh, today we are going to be wrapping up the final storyline of this game. So I'm sure most of you guys know there are three storylines. There's the main one, the cultists, and then there's also the one where you help your dad seal off Atlantis. So we've done the Atlantis one as well as the main storyline. The only thing we have left is this right here, hunting the cult of Cosmos. And uh, as you guys are going to see here... I've been going ham. I went through and I defeated all the, the little guys out here, all the little grunts, I guess you could call them, and uh, now we have all the intel we need for these last four medium guys, and then once we take those out, we're going to get access to the Ghost of Cosmos, which is the, the leader of the cult. So, you guys can see here, we defeated Demos, which is our sister, we uh, killed Pausanias, he was one of the kings of Sparta, took him out. We killed Cleon towards the end of the game. This guy, Palamon the Wise, he just kind of randomly showed up. I was clearing one area and he ended up being one of the cultist members. I didn't even know we were hunting him, but uh, we took him out too. And now it's time to, uh, to get these last four. So let's go ahead and open this up. We're gonna unveil who this is. Nothing gets past the eyes of Cosmos. Nyx, all right. So we're gonna go ahead and track her and let's see, uh, Let's see where she's gonna be. Where's she at? She's up here. Okay, not too bad. Inside the city of Athens, we're gonna fast travel over that way. And let's, uh, let's take the first one out. Feels good to be back in Athens, man. Bustling, vibrant city. Ever since we, uh, we took down Cleon and brought it into the... The good, good era, I guess you could say. Out of the Dark Ages. He was, a uh, Merciless, very uh, ruthless leader. And it feels good to see see the city happy and bustling again. But uh, here we go, boys. This cultist is going to be right over here. I was kind of hoping that some of these middle, like the, these last few cultists, I was hoping they were going to have a little bit more of like a storyline to them. They might have missions and stuff, but it's looking like it might be might be more of the same. Just run up and kill them. I don't know. We'll see what happens. Should be good. Gonna be right over this, uh, over this little thing. She doesn't even know it's coming. Ooh, Zoe the Gut Wrencher is right here. Are we gonna be able to just walk up and one tap her? Ooh, no, dude, she's a beast. All right. Get it with the fire sword. Yes, sir. She's got some some people trying to help her out here. I was trying to use our attack, but we had no, uh... What the heck? We need more of our... Whatever it's called. Stamina. The... Where did she go? Oh, she's right there. Okay. Give me a sec. We don't have any of our adrenaline, so I keep trying to use our abilities, and then it, it just not... It doesn't work, because... We have no adrenaline. Where did she go? Dude, what the... Get out of here. Come on, there it is. Woo! Yes, sir. Oh, that was a brutal ending. Gotta confirm the kill. Get these guys out of here. Confirm it. Bada bing, bada boom. There she goes, baby. One less evil. All right. Got the dagger of Cronus, too. A level 50 gold sword. That looks pretty good, man. All right, so we're gonna go back to cultists here. Let's see what we got going on. We got a new clue for the main leader. All right, now we're gonna be going to this guy, Undiscovered Sage. Unveil Past, who this is. Present and future, kneel to the cultists of Cosmos. Dude, he looks pretty insane. I'm not gonna lie. He's a level 52. All right, where is uh, where's he gonna be? He's gonna be all the way down here. Right next to our fast travel point. That's perfect. All right, we gotta get out of here. We gotta lose these civilians that are hunting us down, and I'll uh I'll see you in a sec. Dude, he is—he's running. What are you? Is he running from a bear? Is that bear his pet? I don't—I don't really know what to what to assume here. We're just gonna go for it. Ooh. 
We took him down most of the way just like that, dude. We'll take it. All right, this is... This is not good. All right, we killed him. We killed him. Woo! That critical assassination put in some work right there. I'm not going to lie. We got to run, though. We're going to have to run back and confirm that kill as soon as we get the chance. But for now, we just got to hide. There's a good bush. There's no bushes around here, dude. Here we go. That's what I was looking for. I feel kind of bad, dude. That bear is just sitting down next to his master. He's just like, what the heck happened? Okay, I think we're good. Oh, God. The bear's still here, dude. I'm sorry, Mr. Bear. I feel, I feel kind of bad, dude. Like, I, I didn't want to have to kill you, but you're just camping on your man's body. You kind of left me with no choice. Got to run these guys far enough away from the body so that we can confirm it before they hit us again. Boom, there it is. Cultist down. We're good. Back up out of here, bro. Nobody asked y'all anything. All right, I'm gone. Typhon's mace. Looks good. Let's, uh, let's try to get out of here and move on to the next guy if we can. Here we go. All right. Heroes of the Cult quest has been completed. Looking good to me. Let's go ahead and open this thing up and see what we got going on next. Dude, we're flying through this so far. All right, another little clue, clue there complete. Looks good. Let's go ahead and unveil the cult Sage. The cosmos will burn the old world to ashes and build a new. Go ahead and track her. See, uh, see what's going on with her. She's going to be on Kios. Right up here in the, the little fort. All right. Let's head that way. Our next cultist is up here, just around the corner. Whoop. Okay. Unfortunately, somebody just saw us, but that's all right. Woo! Dude, she's gonna be a beast, I can already tell. And we're gonna have to fight all these guys along with her. Got him. Hold on a second. Let me just hit you with one of these. Woo! That's how we do it, baby. Yes, sir. Hurry up, hurry up, hurry up. Confirm, confirm, confirm. Can you confirm it for me? Come on. Dude, what the heck? It disappeared. I didn't even do that. I'm gonna have to defeat these guys the normal way, I guess. Or just push them out of here and then confirm it. There we go. Perfect. I don't care about actually completing the area. I'm just trying to trying to knock out these cultists as fast as possible, man. All right, here we go. Let's just run. Let's get out of here. Worshippers of the bloodline's been completed. Looking good, fellas. Dude, I'm just gonna go run and jump off the side of this mountain. Why not? Skirt! See ya! Skirt! And just like that, we're a ghost, baby. Bro, we only have one more. This is it. This is, we, we have one more clue that we need. So the ghost is a liar. The ghost planned the death of Pericles. The ghost controls both sides of the war. The ghost longs for freedom, planning to herald a new era. Uses faith in the gods to manipulate all and controls Athenian politics. What's our last clue here? This is, uh... This is Those it. that do not fear cosmos can learn to breathe beneath the waves. Dude, look at his yellow eyes. Those are kind of a little bit creepy, not gonna lie. All right, here we go. So this is our, our second to last one, boys. Where's, uh... Oh, it's down here. Dude, he is just out in the middle of the water. All right, we're gonna have some naval warfare here. Let's go ahead and go to the Iapia fort and uh, head south. Well, here we are, boys. This is uh, the furthest south we've been. We are literally like on the edge of the world, dude. We're about to fall off the end because it's flat, you know what I mean? So, gotta make sure, uh, gotta make sure we stay safe, but here we go. 
Come on, baby. Honestly, we have not upgraded our ship quite as much as we probably could have over the course of this game. We never really went for all the little secret ancient tablets and stuff, and that's how you upgrade the ships, which I think it would have been beneficial to us, but at this point, I'm hoping we can take these guys without too much trouble. Come on, Come on baby. Take him down. We don't need to board him. We're gonna get a little bit of health back. We don't need it all. all right, we're good there. So we took that little ship down. He's on this one. Do we just go straight at this one? I was hoping to take out, you know, each of the little ones one by one before really getting into the big battle, but. Should we stay back and avoid the fight? The Hydra, bro. Okay. That was a big hit right there, boys. We've got him to about half health. We're okay. Just keep hitting him like this. We might be able to make something happen. Just circling him, doing as much damage as we possibly can. Come on, baby, hurry up. Hurry up. Throw everything you got at him. All we have to do is take him down. Come on. Come on. Come on. This is so close, dude. Oh, we got him. We got him. Just down him. Down him. There it is. Done. Done. Get out of here. Sail away. Oh, boys. Oh my goodness, all clues have been discovered for the Cultist of Cosmos. We are now going to be able to unveil the final one. Holy cow, dude. Alright, that I got a little bit, a little bit scared for. We've got a fresh start quest. Hold on, I don't even know what that is. So let's, let's see. Fresh start. With one cult cultist left alive, it was time for Alexios to fulfill his vow to find them he was called to the place where he learned of their existence. He'd have to go back where it all began. And we are going to be going into the cultist's lair. Are you kidding me, dude? All right, hold on. Let me let me see what we have here. Can we unveil yet? It's a woman. You've seen it yourself. Aspasia. The future belongs to us now. Old gods and Hanu be praised. No freaking way, dude. It's Aspasia. She's the one that killed Pericles. Dude, what? We thought she was our friend from the very beginning at all of Pericles' parties and stuff. Like, it totally makes sense. It absolutely makes sense, but dude, no freaking way. All right, we're going to go take her down. I mean, there's there's nothing left for us to do, man. Let's uh, see what we can do. Ooh, we could have a cultist crew theme. That's pretty dope. I'm, I'm going to rock with that. And then we also, I think we got... Some new weapons out of that. Ooh. Okay, give me a second. Oh no, there's nothing, nothing too crazy new there. Oh, Rod of Asclepius. Should we rock with that? That's our big boy. Yeah, I like it. All right, dude, this is dope. And hold on. So we've got 22 fragments. Do we need 23, or is 22 what we need? Oh, we can go upgrade the spear too. So let's go do that first. So this is gonna be our, our sixth and final upgrade, I believe. We're gonna head back to Andros. We're gonna upgrade our spear for the final time. And then we're gonna go take down the Colt for the final time. It's just so crazy to think about everything we've done in this game, man. Like how, how many crazy adventures we've been on for the past few weeks playing this thing, dude. Like I, I remember our first time coming down here. Now this is our fifth or sixth. The final one. It's crazy. Forge activated. Synchronizing retransmission chronosity. Contact engaged. I don't even know what this is gonna unlock for us, dude. I don't think our uh 
I don't think our, our abilities can upgrade anymore. Legacy restored. It got us an achievement or a trophy. Spear upgraded. But like, what, what does that do for us? You know what I mean? I don't... Hmm. Interesting. Yeah, that's weird. I, I don't think it actually did anything for us. I don't even think the damage of the spear or anything gets any better. So, anyway, let's go back to our quests here. We're gonna go to uh, our last Odyssey. Like, this is it. This is the end. This is completely over with, this game. It, we're done. It's over. Which is what's so crazy. All right, where is this thing? I always... The little, like, gold diamond is kind of hard to find sometimes. Sometimes I'll zoom in. Just so it'll show up on the side, and then you can trace it all the way up. It's up here. All right. Back to the Temple of Apollo. I remember the first time we went, like, Herodotus, and he helped us out with getting into this cultist meeting and, and all this other stuff. Dude, this is going to be really awkward because we're going to go down there and she's going to be the only one in there. She's going to be like calling a meeting and everybody, literally everybody's dead. The only person that's not dead is Demos and Demos is no longer on her side. So the fact that we, we show up is, is going to be kind of funny. This is bittersweet, man. Like I, I'm excited to see what happens, but I also kind of want to cry a little bit because this is it. We better get some DLC missions for this game. I'd be really upset if we didn't get any DLC missions, dude. We have to, right? Like, there's there's got to be some stuff coming out. The last Assassin's Creed game, they had, like, special boss battles and stuff pop up all over the place. I don't know, dude. I'm, I'm hoping we do. Good news is we got Red Dead Redemption 2 just around the corner, so... We're gonna be balling out on that for a while, but... I, I really, truly loved this game. This is my favorite Assassin's Creed I've ever played. Why is our mother talking? We're hearing things. Look at that snake, dude. Alexios. Our father. It's never supposed to be like this. Decades ago, a group of people gathered together to uphold a theory which they believed could control the universe. That the world functioned in equal parts, order and disorder. But some fell lovingly into the wicked arms of chaos, and the cult of Cosmos was born. They abused their power, casting the Greek world into eternal war, one you were created to stop. In destroying the cult, you have done what I could not. You are a hero, but this imbalance comes with a price, my child. For without chaos, there is supreme order, a loss of progression and freedom. But there is still hope. Hope in you. Hope in the future you will bring. We must fix the mistakes of the past. Use the staff. Repair the rift in the universe. The world depends on you, Alexios. You need to be the hero again. So, you've seen it too then. It's beautiful, isn't it? What are you doing here? You killed the last member of the cult. Well, just about. What? It's true. I was their leader. But only for a moment, it seemed. When your sister came along, it changed everything we were aiming for. Malaka. So you were after us. Not you. Your bloodline. People like Leonidas, like you, have always posed a threat. 
Then we met and you surprised me. You were nothing like Demos. Why not just use me? I was in the palm of your hand. You made me optimistic that you could help me bring down the cult that had become so corrupt. And you did, albeit unknowingly. <laughs> Tell I'm me going for it. To guts. You know what I do to cultists, Tasmasia. I didn't want to lie to you anymore. Now that they're gone, we can work together. I think we'd make a good match, don't you? I just don't understand. What about this pyramid? How does it work? Why does the cult have it? I've been trying to figure out all of that myself. It's as much of a mystery to you as it is to me. This pyramid has been worshipped by the cult for decades. And we have used it to replace the Oracle of Delphi, the most trusted person in all the Greek world. Using the people's reliance on a pantheon of dead gods would help to reshape humanity in our favor. The pyramid holds a mysterious power to see into time. But only certain people can activate it. People like Zemos and the ones in your bloodline. But you've seen something too. I don't know how or why, but it did show me... something. What did you see? I saw you. In the vision, you destroyed the pyramid and you destroyed the cult. I saw what would come after. After the cult? We will be replaced by a new kind of order. Control under the reign of a philosopher king. There would be a movement away from the old gods toward rational society, built in a kingdom by the people, for the people. And I must find someone to lead them. But I couldn't achieve any of this with the cult and their chaotic regime. So I let them carry out their plans and let the time of the cult of Cosmos come to an end on its own. Wait, did Pericles know? I wanted to protect him, so I kept him in the dark. He would have had his own opinions, but he was never supposed to die. That is the truth. I can understand that. You've made questionable choices. But I think that was the right one. I trust you her. Knew him. All he did was worry about the state of the Greek world. If I told him, it would have ruined him. I think. So, what happens now? We shift focus. We steer towards a new republic under one supreme rule. A dream I'll make a reality. But it is still a dream. One that isn't realistic. Abandon what you know and just imagine. Forget democracy. No more blue and red. Just citizens working for a greater good. This is crazy. It won't work, Aspasia. It didn't work. It's not crazy. It's enlightened. Once people in Athens get wind of this, they'll come to know they've wanted it all along. Even you. Uh, I'm not sure. You've spent your whole life thinking for yourself. Let go. What I plan will require you to trust me. Come with me. This future's not a dream. <laughs> I mean, y'all know what I'm gonna go for. Sorry. I suppose that means you trust me. I don't know what that means. I'll tell you what it means. Love is a singular comfort, Alexios. What comes next means harmony for everyone. You should go. Lead your new republic. I won't be the leader. We need someone with the knowledge of a philosopher and the wisdom of a king. That's a tall order these days. I couldn't have done this without you, Alexios. You're doing the right thing. I always try to do what's right. Then we're after the same thing. Alexios, there is much left to do now. I can weather any storm. 
I mean, I was thinking we should destroy it, but instead we got to kiss her and we destroyed it. So we, we really got the best of both worlds, right? I ain't mad at it. We're back outside here. We got Aspasia's circlet. I think that's a, a headpiece. We defeated Aspasia. Let's go ahead and open the, uh, open the cultist menu here and see what we got going on. Because that's, I, I think that's it, dude. It's done. Literally. All the cultists are down if we go to our quests here. We have no main quests left. They're just side quests out in the world. And, uh, and that's, that's all we've got, man. What is, I want to see what this thing looks like. The, the little headpiece. Oh, we got a bunch of cool armor. Demigod's chest plate. Demigod's belt. Demigod's boots. I like those gold boots. Those are dope. Demigod's bracers. And uh, then we got this thing. Aspasia's circlet. <laughs> so fashion forward, Alexios. I love it. I actually do kind of like seeing his face, though. But uh, anyway, guys, I I think that's it. I mean, there, there's side quests left that we can do, but I'm not going to go through and do all the side quests in the world. That'll take too long. And I, That's it. That's the end of the game. That is the end of the end. That is the, the, the epilogue. We already beat the game, but this is like the, the final thing that we could potentially do that has any sort of, like, particular meaning. It's not just a side quest, so... I hate to leave you guys here, but um, I, I think that's it. Like I said, if we get any DLC missions, we will definitely be playing those. This has been one of the best games that I've played in a really long time, and I just want to thank you guys so much for joining me on this ride. It's uh, It's been a really good one. Your guys' support has been amazing. I've had a lot of fun just kind of, you know, obviously playing, but then like seeing your guys' reactions and the, the comments and the, the love and stuff. It's... Uh, it's been a good couple weeks, so uh, thank you guys so much for joining me. Hope you guys enjoyed. Drop a like, subscribe if you haven't already, and uh, I'm going to see you guys in Red Dead Redemption 2 here very, very soon. Thanks for watching, guys. Peace out.